Hi guys, I'm Spencer Pratt. You know me from winning Snapchatter of the year, or maybe you remember me from the hills and you probably hated me. I hated myself also. It was horrible, I became a monster. So I set out on a new journey to find love, to heal my mind, body, and spirit. And now I wanna share these life lessons. Spencer Pratt will heal you. Today I'm hanging out with my homie Sarah McDaniel, AKA Crotchy. Sarah is a model. Sarah is a YouTuber. She's a stop motion video producer. Sarah is also known to be a conspiracy theorist. Put in simplest form, the delete button for the entire universe based on the physics we know right now, which also could be false. She suffers from both pain and anxiety. So it's time for me to really work my magic. We're gonna pay a visit to a witch, a real life witch with spells and potions and magic. Hey, Sarah. How Hello. are you? I am a little nervous for today. How are you feeling? Are you ready for this? I'm really excited. I love just venturing into a bunch of weird shit. I think everyone has a little bit of witch in them. You have a conspiracy about this also? I mean, I'm mostly into astrophysics and things like that, so I think it kind of ties into it. She's into the stars, obviously, so. Have you ever met a witch? Not knowingly. I think they definitely know people that have witchy vibes to them. Bitches. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> I, I thought we were talking about people in Hollywood. Well, I am very confident that this witch is exactly what you needed to heal your anxiety and your back pains. Are you Let's ready? Do it. Yeah. yeah. My name is Maja Dau, and I'm a practicing witch. I work with nature, healing of the mind, body, and spirit. Hi. Hi, guys. Hello. I'm a little nervous. I'm just never sat down with, may I say, witch? Is that politically correct or spiritually correct? It's all of those things. Witches have a negative connotation. Bad word, yeah. yeah. I think they're always spread kind of as evil. Mostly by people who don't know that they themselves are evil. Judging a person as evil is satanic. So what do we have here? So today for you guys, we have a couple of things. First, I would like to give you a clearing. Then we're gonna have a potion. And then we can also do some transformation using a technique of creating a golem of yourself. Did you guys come with any specific issues that you'd like to deal with today? I deal a lot with anxiety, with mm -hmm. uh, pretty much everything in my life. I'm just a very anxious person. And my lower back on my right side, I have a kind of a sharp pain from lifting weights. Mm -hmm. So that's kind of the things I would like to focus on. My concern today is really only Sarah's healing. I'm just a facilitator. You're uh, cute. Let's, let's get into it yeah. here. Let's Great. heal Sarah. Let's get started with the clearing based on Qigong, the Chinese technique. And I will place my hands on your back while I listen to the music. The music helps me feel the feelings. And then briefly, it'll just give you like a little zhuzh, like taking a shower. Can you guys hold hands with each other? Deep breath in. The clearings, they're based on martial arts techniques where I move the energy in my body and I work with Holy Spirit to transfer the energy into the other people. One more time, take a deep breath in. I'm feeling this witch's energy, got a good vibe, I'm liking it. Feels like there's an electric bolt just going down my entire body, it's crazy. Breathe out. Okay, that was it. You guys feel clearer? Wow, you did some healing, I feel good. That really hit me. Oh, I, I think it hit me harder than it hit you. <laughs> yeah. I could definitely feel the electromagnetic it's electric. energy from your fingers. If I do it for like five hours, I can literally set off car alarms when I walk by. A lot of times people who smoke weed will feel it right away. Maybe Sarah, I, I personally, I just drink water. <laughs> what an angel. The potion I'm making today is a concoction of reishi mushroom, several other funguses. We have a good anxiety herb, which is astragalus. We have reishi mushroom. It goes into your body and finds out what's wrong and then just fixes it. Are we gonna smoke this stuff? No, we're gonna make a little tea. 
Ah. Yeah. <laughs> Mugwort. You guys will have crazy dreams tonight. This nice. one's really good for lucid dreaming. And then we have dandelion root, which is really good for anger clearing. Ah, she points at me for anger. I ride my anger, people. I ride it like a wave. Are you guys ready for some potion? It works best if you have hot water, or you can even use alcohol. Oh. It's a good way to make your booze into medicine. I would argue that my booze already is medicine. Alcohol is medicine. <laughs> to, to life. And to spirit. Mmm. <laughs> Tastes very earthy. Mm -hmm. Like I'm drinking out of a like a pond. Some dirt tones. Uh-huh. Definitely. Mm -hmm. That's in a dandelion. I like it. Yeah, let me see you finish it off. Why don't you? I'm gonna right after you. You I'm... wanna race me? Yeah, to the most lit AF dreams. Ever. <laughs> That's medicine. Why did we do that that fast? That wasn't necessary. Woo! I feel like a witch. I feel like a dang witch. You better watch out, haters. I may put a spell on you. The practice of making a little self of yourself goes back a long way. It's called an effigy, like voodoo dolls. You can do it however you like. I've only heard negative things with voodoo dolls. Hopefully it doesn't come back and bite me in the ass. Hello, <laughs> I'm Brad Daddy. I have a really big head. Spencer has a very powerful golem, which radiates solar energy. And for him, if he can use his power for himself, he'll find that he'll be able to radiate much more to other people with abundance. Stand. Sarah's golem is already beautiful, so what I really want her to be able to do is to see her own inner beauty and power, which is really all she needs. Okay, so now we're gonna give you guys a little saint protection. This is holy water from Padre Pio. We're just gonna give you guys a little spritz. What was that that just got in my eye? <laughs> holy water. Oh. And then this is from Saint Benedict, and he has a key. So we're just gonna give you guys a little. Right in the head. Because it leaves an impression. And then we're gonna concentrate on what would you guys like to transform, place it in the belly of your little guy. And now I'd like you guys to concentrate on that same thing and draw a shape on that piece of paper for me. So symbolic representation, it's using your subconscious to focus on something by making a representative of the thing. I'm not gonna say your circle's basic, but I won't judge your, <laughs> so it's, it's a very great circle. Continuous. It's true, that's the Aruberus, which is the snake that eats its tail, that's the cycle. And yours is as above, so below. It's the conjunction when two opposite forces come to meet each other. It's very sexual. Oh. <laughs> so what we're gonna do is we're gonna burn the paper. Are you guys ready to release it and let it change into a brand new thing that you don't have to carry around anymore? Doesn't that sound nice? Make a wish. Woo! Whoa! That was sick. Can we do that again? <laughs> <laughs> you should do it all oh, the time. Oh my gosh. Do you guys feel that it's released? Do you feel a little better, a little clearer? I feel great. Good. I don't feel anxious. How does your back feel? It doesn't hurt when I move it on this side, so that's good. I feel very rested. There's not like that inner spazzy mindset going on anymore. It's just very like a level. It's an equilibrium. That's yeah. peace. Peace isn't just good. It's when you take the good and the bad and you meet them in the middle. You're on the same page as me because I am out here flying like a dang right. hummer. You can't fly with all these weights dragging down your balloon, man. You gotta rise up. I want one more healing. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, you guys, for being such good sports. Thank you for your time and energy. Yes. That was very special. I wish I was a witch because she just seems so in tune with everything. I'm nervous for the dreams. I was not planning on drinking mm -hmm. all the the tea spell. I hope they're positive, but they can get as weird as they want as long as they stay positive. Do you believe you're healed? I absolutely feel a lot more calm and clear-headed. I think there definitely was some healing properties going on. Yeah, but yeah. I freaking had a freaking healing blast. I really do respect these holistic rituals that people are using right now, and I feel more calm and clear-headed, and I feel my energy completely change throughout my body. Thank you so much for joining me for this healing. What a day! And now I feel like it can fly.
Thank you for watching. For more of your favorite Spencer Bratt will heal you moments, click here to subscribe. And if you want more videos, click here.